Marco Polo glorified his adventures in riding while doing a little time out in a prison right here in Genoa. And as is the case with much of history, we remember the guys with good PR, and his book became a runaway bestseller. Not an easy feat during a time before the printing press was even invented. Marco Polo was doing time in prison because the two city-states of Venice and Genoa had a brief little war. Marco was fighting for Venice because that was his hometown and was captured, thus landing him in the slammer right here in Genoa. <laughs> It'd be funny if I hit one and they all just kind of... <laughs> Many people scoffed at Marco Polo's exploits, thinking that they were pure fantasy. But almost 200 years later, Christopher Columbus, who grew up right here in Genoa, Italy, would read Marco Polo's book and became enamored with the idea of visiting these strange lands that Marco Polo described. Columbus would eventually decide that he would pick up where Marco Polo left off.